morning dear students i parul madam welcome you all in the online computer class today we are going to start a new lesson lesson number 6 notepad let's start children have you seen a notepad notepad is the one on which we all can write with a pencil or a pen but children do you know there is a notepad in our computer also want to learn more about notepad come on let's learn about notepad children do you write question answers composition hard words in your notebook all these things we can write in notepad present on our computer notepad is used for typing text on the computer children this is our notepad and this is computer's notepad on our notepad we write with a pencil or a pen whereas in computer's notepad we type using the keyboard now we will learn how to start a notepad present on our computer to start notepad follow the following steps first of all click on start button then select all programs then select accessories and finally click or select notepad the notepad window appears as shown in this figure this is notepad window first let us create a new document for that click on file menu then click on new option to create a new document children do you see a small blinking line on the monitor we all know that it is known as the cursor the cursor shows the position where we have to type we can start typing from here onwards type in a few lines say on my house as shown in this figure using keyboard word wrap so this composition i have typed in notepad window using my keyboard children now let us learn about an important feature of notepad that is the word wrap feature step 1 click on the format button step 2 we can see a tick mark on the left side of the word wrap option if we click on this option the tick mark disappears again if we click on word wrap option the tick mark reappears step 3 remove the tick mark by clicking on word wrap option in the format menu children did you notice what happens to the text you will see that the entire text is shown in one line only this is the horizontal scroll bar 
it is present at the bottom of the notepad window this bar can be moved left and right using the computer mouse to read the full text now select the word wrap option again in the format menu the text automatically moves to the next line in the notepad window and appears like this again font means handwriting in notepad we can also change the font that is the handwriting then style of writing then size of the writing in other words we can say that font is a design for typed letters numbers and symbol to change the font font style and font size of your text follow this steps step 1 select the font option in the format menu step 2 the font dialog box will appear as shown in this figure a dialog box helps you to make choices step 3 select a font that you like step 4 select a font style you like step 5 select a size you like step 6 finally click okay the text will now appear as shown in this figure see children the change of handwriting first when i typed the font that is handwriting was like this after i changed the font from font option in format menu the handwriting became like this and of bigger size now children we will learn to save our text in notepad for that click file menu then click save as option the save as dialog box appears children this is save as dialog box select the drive and the folder then type the name of the file next click the save button so even if we turn off our computer our file will remain present now we will see how to close notepad on the computer first click file menu in that click exit option notepad will be closed now so today we learned about notepad present on our computer hope to meet you in next online computer class thank you take care